I'm, I'm very happy to be here. My name is Ted Metz, and to reiterate what has already been said, that's what I was planning to say, that Georgia started out as a slave state. Georgia started out as a penal colony, and it has not changed. It's been a penal colony ever since. We do have the highest number of people in jail, the highest incarceration rate, the highest number of people that can go on probation for a parking ticket. It's just crazy. The overcriminalization of a plant that God made is just absolutely ridiculous, especially when you look at the legislative history of how marijuana became illegal in the first place. Prior to the 1930s, the leading oil that was used in oil-based paint was hemp oil. And how did that happen to get replaced with petroleum oil? Big money lobbyists in Congress in the 30s saying, hey, we've got oil now, we don't need hemp anymore, let's, let's get a favorable legislation and squash it. Big Pharma is huge into the suppression of the medical benefits of marijuana. A lot of people self-medicate because they can't afford the Xanax, the Prozac, the you know, the, the lot of all those other pills that, that Big Pharma gets you on a recurring payment plan. Your insurance company pays $700, you pay a $30 copay. Somebody's making out and it's a taxpayer expense for medications that are not even needed because they could be replaced by a plant you can grow in your garden. I want to see marijuana relabeled cannabis, which its real name is, and I want to see people <coughs> to be able to grow it in their garden just like tomatoes and cucumbers and everything else. There is no psychoactive components in a live marijuana plant. It does not become psychoactive until after it is decarboxylated, which requires time and heat. So the thing I've heard about, oh, there's going to be stone rabbits running around everywhere, that's, that's BS because it can't happen chemically. The molecules, the tetrahydrocannabinoid, uh, uh, cannabinolic acid, which is not decarboxylated, is not psychoactive. It does not become psychoactive until it is treated with heat or chemical processing. It is completely inert. There is nothing harmful about the plant. The benefits of the plant, not only to animals, but also to people, is, is huge. And it's being suppressed by big pharma because they're making, they're making bank off of taking the same chemicals that are found in the plant and turning them into a process to be able to sell them through the FDA approval process, which is another big lie. I will be one more second and then I'll stop. I, I would really like you guys just to say this is ridiculous because the whole drug war was perpetrated by people who had enough money to influence legislation to profit off the backs of the people. This has got to stop. Yes, thank you. Chelsea Jarrett.